Hi guys, welcome back to the workshop. Today I'm trying to get some experience on the late. I was trying to make a cup, but I finished with a candle holder. So I started with a wood log that I split in half because I didn't need the whole length of it. Then I take my compass to make a circle so I can use my bandsaw to cut as close as possible to the line so I can get a nice cylinder so it won't wobble too much on my lathe. Once that was done, I went on my lathe and installed the piece and start turning the piece until it's perfectly round. So to round my log, I use a roughing gouge and the technique I used was just to push some rings across the whole length of my piece until it was perfectly round. Once it was perfectly round, I put some measurements so I can start carving my cup and I even add some little ridges in it just to try off some tools. Then it was time to, to sand it and for this I used some water so I can raise the grain because a cup is supposed to be washed after so just by raising the grain and sanding it uh, at one point the grain will just stop raising. Then I went off my lathe and just cut the excess material and kept the cup and I clean off the edges uh, using my belt sander. So it was at that point that I realized that my project of making a cup won't work because the bit I'm trying to use won't cut the wood. The wood was, was way too hard and it just won't work. So I decided to make a bunch of holes in it and just by using a chisel and mallet, smash them down, but that didn't work. The wood was really, really hard. So I just decided to cover it and turn it into a candle holder. I made a cap out of pine with some 45 bevel on it just to cover it. So before gluing the cap on, I decided to put my logo. Then I drilled a hole in the cap so it can hold a candle and then I just applied glue on it and glued it on the piece and I put some weight on it so it could dry. Once it was dry I used some sandpaper to remove the excess glue that dried on the piece So like always, I finished my project by removing all the dust particle with some mineral spirit and finish it off with some wipe on poly. Here you go guys, I finally finished my candle holder. It's looking pretty good. I love the effect I gave on it. I'm a little bit disappointed it's not a cup, but you know, I have the other piece of the log that I can turn. So when I have a chuck, I'm gonna turn this one into a real cup. So if you're excited for this, please give me a like, please subscribe, and I'll see you next week. Ciao.